Honestly, it's the greatest honor of my life. I never dreamed that we would get into such a globally celebrated and acclaimed festival. And it's so fitting because our story is such a global story, so we couldn't ask for a more perfect job. So I first discovered the Henyo when I was eight years old. I was on a trip to Jeju with my parents and I saw them and I was so struck by them immediately because they cut such a striking, badass, tough figure and I fell in love with them and I grew up um, kind of following them until and I started going to visit them and I decided to tell this story once I found out that they were on the verge of extinction. This film is hopefully inspiring, motivating, um, educational, an homage, and a prayer for their continued existence. I mean, honestly, I really just hope people get to know the Henyo. I think that they're a very unknown community of women that have been inspiring Korean women for centuries, and um, I would just love to that people around the world started to finally know who they are and recognize them for the inspirational heroes that they are. I mean, I have so many favorite memories from working on the film, but I think my favorite memory of working on the film was while we were filming the Henyos, they were always breaking the fourth wall and trying to feed us, feed the camera crew, feed the DPs, feed me, while we were filming them. And that's just the way that they show love and care is to make sure people are fed. So. Well, I mean, the story is really about this incredible community of women that is specific to uh, Korea, but their their resilience, their strength, and their determination is universal to all genders, all nationalities, all people. But also, this story is about the conservation of our oceans and the steward a better stewardship of our oceans. And there's nothing more. Uh, global than the ocean currents that run across the entire world. And so they're trying to save our ocean, so it really is a story that's relevant to every country in the world. I hope the audiences take away a better understanding of what's happening to the ocean due to climate change and global warming. But also, I love that they're going to have recognition of the Henyo, and that's their message too, is like, just as a species, we need to be better stewards of the ocean. And most people can't see what's happening underneath the ocean, but they can, and they're the ones telling us about it. So I hope people are listening to their message that they speak about in the film.